Good morning, June 18th, waking up to this little fella right here. Yeah. Hi, how are you? Good sleep last night, huh? <laughs> so sweet. Mama got some sleep in a good like five hours, which is surprising for me because usually I don't. I really had to force myself to sleep because um, Brian's not here and I have to have the energy to stay up with baby boy. Hubby's still out there um, working a quick job. It's uh, uh, quite a while, uh, distance, so that's why he's just staying at a hotel over there. And um, hopefully he'll be home today. He usually takes care of baby around this time up until 11 when I, you know, catch up on some rest. So it was kind of difficult to force myself to sleep, but I think overall with the exhaustion of taking care of baby by myself, helped me sleep some. So. <sighs> Hubby wants another one, so I'm kind of like, can't even think right now. Look at him. And once again, baby wants mama, wants up all day. I actually really do like him in these onesies that like, you know, look at that, so cute. That has no legs, especially in this area, it's really hot. Um, the only problem is it's really hard to just, you know, zip him back in. Well, not zip him, but button him back in. He's just squirming everywhere. With the magnetic knees, it's just you put it on and then good to go. It just kind of clicks right away and, yeah. <laughs> Or is it everywhere on the ground, huh? Huh? Anyways, um, it's been a couple days and um, I left his mouth alone because uh, it was bleeding somewhere in there and I didn't want to agitate it, especially for a baby. So um, we are going to try his toothbrush today. Yay! Um, I'm sure by now it's already healed, but um, we're going to uh, have some fun with Brushing our teeth and daily hygiene, okay, baby. Um, these these scissors are pretty bomb. Like seriously, I hate when scissors don't come apart, and um, there's always like crap on the sides or insides. Well, these come off, and you can put it in the dishwasher, and then once it's done, click it back in, and you're good to go. So it cuts. It has a beer opener right here, so you can open your beer. Right there, and then um, you can also open the cans on this side, on this end, and then if you take this off, you can start slicing um, potatoes or whatever you want that way, or peeling. Loves I'm looking for scissors forever, and um, finally bit my tongue and bought some because I know I have a lot, but they're just scattered everywhere and. My brother would throw them into the dishwasher and they would get all rusty, so it's like, ugh, annoying. And then finally, I found something that's suitable and love it. It's on my Amazon page, okay, so check it out. This product is not a toy, adult supervision, okay? Okay, baby. Brushing instruction, here, this is important. Listen up, girl. Wet the bristles and apply appropriate amount of toothpaste. Divide oral area into up, down, left, right. So, okay, press on power. Ah, 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 ah. Yeah. Move the section 30 seconds until all four sections of the mouth have been. <laughs> okay. Press power button to turn off. Brush will power off after two minutes. That's interesting. Why would it do it after two minutes? Okay, it has two heads. So here you have one for when they're around zero to 18 months, which is this one. And the other one is zero to three years. Okay, honey, this is your brush. Zero to three years, and then we, we replace it. 
Okay, I replace it when you get older. Let's see. Okay, here we have the AA batteries, triple A. Let's see. Well, let's see, God. Let's see. Let's see. So it's supposed to brush his teeth every morning. Oh, look at that light. It lit up, honey. Oh. All right. Let's brush your teeth in the morning, okay? Open your mouth. Like what's going on? Let me see your teeth. <laughs> he wants to eat it. Okay. Very, very cute. I like it already. Oh my gosh. Alright, so um let me try to cut this off so we could keep this for when you're older, honey. Okay. Uh, see, came off easily. I hate like cutting through this without the proper tools. All right, so um, we have the natural baby toothpaste right here by Dr. Brown, okay? And then we have the Colgate Zero for kids or oh, whatever. And these are flavored, so it's, it's good for baby to, you know, open up to some toothpaste and brushing their teeth. Okay, let me put a little bit on, like a pee drop, they say, a pee drop. Are you ready, honey? First time brushing your teeth, I'm so excited. This toothbrush is cuter than mine. I'll get myself one too. Okay, let me see. Ah. I gotta turn him around, he's just really like, not in a position where mama can see. Okay, let me see. Everything in the mouth. It should be easier. Everything in the mouth. Okay. You dispersed it. Okay, so the first press is a to light up this, and the second one is the thing. How fun! <laughs> Okay, it's kind of hard to get into his teeth because he's just trying to eat it. How cute! I love it! I mean, granted it's a little hard to get him, but after you get used to it and put some, some force into getting his teeth, then he's okay. Okay, Gong? Yeah? Let's try to brush our teeth every day, okay? All right, turn on. Can I get your teeth? I think it's easier if we have two people here. Hold him down. <laughs> now he's just like. There's your teeth. <laughs> He's not hating it, which is what is cool. Okay. Good job. Let's do some more, okay? I let the little cub out of the cage. Lion's den, and he is so excited. Super, super excited. He can't even contain himself. Look at him. <laughs> What are you happy about? What are you so happy about? Happy to be out? It's kind of like our COVID time, you know? Everyone's just going crazy, being quarantined. Once you let them out, they're happy, but it's dangerous because, you know, this and all that craziness. So I'm basically here to watch him, make sure he doesn't bump his head. We don't have any um, baby proofing around here, so we're making it nice and... Uh, Snug next to each other, hanging out, watching a movie, and he is just so happy. Like, he's just been cooped up in that room and the other room, and he's just happy. So, 
So I'm like his mask, okay? And this is the COVID. Okay, we're finally out and about, so be careful. Be careful, okay, go. Don't you start with me. Don't you start with me. Gosh. Daddy's home. Two days. This guy's so happy to be out. Does he even recognize you? He even recognize me. Do you even miss me? Nope. We don't like you. you. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I missed you. I missed you. I missed you so much. I drove home for you. Hey, mommy. Spend your time with mommy. Look, look, so big. Just pop your own freaking pants. <laughs> Okay, go roam around. He's excited to be out here. He's like super on some sort of level now. So, um, we got some chicken bites for baby, steamed chicken. And um, it's going to be uh, easy for us to just feed him like little tiny pieces. He loves it. So does Papa. Mm -hmm. So healthy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, good. One more, honey. So every day, we give them like a good 15, 20 little pieces of, of these chicken bites. Yummy. Mm. Mm. Yeah. She just put him in the high chair and he's gonna self-feed himself. I'm okay with this to self-feed because it's not as um, sticky. Like if you give him fruits or like something liquidy, no good. This is good. Mama's happy. I said for dinner, I'm also having um, chicken empanadas from Portos. This is not very good. I wouldn't recommend it. I would recommend the Porto balls or the meat pie or the strudels, but this is too much bread and it's just, yeah, it's not good. Not enough meat. Already a hunk of bread right there. Anyway, it's, um, I'm gonna put baby down in about 20 minutes or so. It's about 8.20 right now. So yeah, look at that, barely any meat. And a lot, a lot of carbs. Whew. And it's kind of like shortbread, that kind of texture. So it feels like it's even more carbs. Baby is knocked out on time, 9.03 p.m. So happy. <laughs> I have a massive headache right now. Like it's excruciating pain. It just keeps pounding and I tried not to, you know, take any medicine because it's gonna affect the baby and so I drink water and do as much as I can but nothing. I'm gonna try to drink some more water and then um catch up on up on my sleep because today I just held baby constantly and um, he was on my lap for the most part. But then when Brian comes home, he's just roaming around the room, just fine. Like, I need to get on Brian's level. Like, what the heck? Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. So glad my husband's home. Be back on track, all that good stuff. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Doodles.